Welcome back Divas. It's your girl TX Beauty Queen 83 and I am coming at you today with a Henry Bindle candle haul. I have not hauled candles on my channel in forever and I am most recently obsessed with Henry Bindle since like February this year. One of my friends brought me back a Henry Bindle candle from New York and I must say I am absolutely obsessed. So I did pick up a few candles and I just wanted to share them with you guys and just kind of read you the scent descriptions and just kind of let you know why I love these candles. I think I'm just obsessed with Henry Bindle, period. The, his style, the store is so chic and fabulous and glamorous. It just seems like Henry Bindle is everything I am. So without further ado, I have a huge bag. Oh, it's so heavy. Oh. It's big. First, I want to share a little bit about his candles with you and just why I have so many. So once a year, Henry Bindle does a annual um, candle sale and that annual sale is $15 candles. The candles did retail for $30, but they reduced the price of the candles down to $25. But um, they don't go on sale like Bath and Body Works. It's like you get 20% off or 30% off of 100. Like that's how that store goes on sale. So when you say $15 candles, it's like you better buy all the candles you need for the year on that day. So first I picked up the candle Fig. This is Fig. And I absolutely adore the uh, packaging. And it's just so luxurious that they come in a little box. So all of Henry Bindle's candles are 9.4 ounces in a frosted glass container and they all burn up to uh, 60 hours, which I can attest to, and they are lead free wick. I will read you the notes of the candles. So this one says the top notes are lemon, bergamot, orange. The heart is fig, peach, jasmine, nougat. And the base notes are some kind of wood that I can't pronounce, musk and amber. I have started to burn this one, but this is what they look like. It's a very heavy weighted glass and it's a frosted glass and it says Henry Bindle, New York. I have burned through probably four or five, completely burned through probably four or five Henry Bindle candles so far this year. Um, I am conservative with burning Henry Bindle candles considering they cost more than your uh, Bath and Body Works candles, which I do like my Bath and Body Works, don't get me wrong, but these scents are just on another level. The scent, the fragrance is just more, I don't even know how to explain it, but it's just more real, more refined. Next up is the cashmere candle. And I will read to you the notes of this candle. The top notes are violet and ginger. The heart is lily of the valley, pepper, leather, woody vanilla, and cedar wood. And this is also another very romantic scent. I could smell it through the boxes. My dog is over here sniffing the candles too right now. Um, but it's a very sexy fragrance. I love it for fall too. The next candle I have is Jade and Jade comes, well, they all have this plastic wrapping on it, by the way, but I haven't burned this one yet. Um, this one reminded me a lot of that fresh bamboo candle that Bath and Body Works had. It's just that it was a little bit more complex and I'll read you the notes. The notes are bamboo leaves, spring dew drops. The heart is sweet honeysuckle jasmine petals and the base is wild green grass and white birch this scent is it's actually kind of springy but it's a very com all of the scents are just so complex it's not just straight bamboo or straight grass this is just so amazing and it's very calming and relaxing i like to burn this candle during bath time Next is another one that I absolutely fell head over heels for and I need more y'all. I need more and I'm afraid that it's going to, well, it's going to get discontinued, but I'm afraid that it's going to sell out before I can get my hands on more. I need like three or four more of these so I can just kind of stash them because they're going to go away. But anyways, so this is Sunset Beach and this, the top notes are uh, aromatic lavender, 
carmidome, uh, citrus. The heart is white jasmine, violet, pink peppercorn. The base is amber and sandalwood, musk. It's so sophisticated, so exotic. It just kind of reminds me like sunset in Hawaii on a summer night. It's very sexy. It's very sophisticated. It's kind of like a cross between something juicy and fruity and Henry Bendel's Sweet 712. So next I have Rose. Rose is one of my all-time favorite scents. I don't know why, but I absolutely love a good rose scent. Rose is in a pink box. I absolutely love this version of rose one of my other favorite rose is true uh no fresh cut roses by yankee candle and i also have the rose essential oils collection by bath and body works i'm mad at myself for not getting more than one the notes on this are the top notes are lemon the heart is rose geranium jasmine and the base notes are warm woods you guys it's just so exquisite i absolutely adore rose by henry bindle and unfortunately it is being discontinued and i am so upset so sunset beach and rose they're also discontinuing jade um i do love jade i had never tried sunset beach prior to me going into henry bindle uh two weekends ago whenever they had the uh, sale going on. So next is not a Henry Bindle signature candle. And unlike last year, um, they only did the signature candles. Well, this one is Henry Bindle's most exquisite, top notch, top of the line candle that they sell. And that is the Henry Bindle Sweet 712 candle. This is the most luxurious candle I have ever smelled in my entire life. I am not going to open this one, un undo the packaging because I already have one that's undone that I had been burning since last year. I burn it little by little because it's that good. You can burn that candle for 30 minutes and it will literally fragrance your entire house on one floor if you have multiple floors. Um, this That candle has no problem fragrancing over a thousand square feet within 30 minutes like that's how strong it is so that is one of my all-time favorite candles in the world in the world so the top notes read italian bergamot peach the heart is jasmine freesia iris rose the base notes are suede white sandalwood and cashmere musk oh i forgot to mention that those are the scents that i bought but I did get multiples of each of the scents. So I have two of the Sunset Beaches. I bought two Jades. I bought two of these Sweet 712. And I also forgot to mention that these candles are not $15 like the other ones um, were clearanced at $15. These were actually clearanced at $25 because the retail price it's 55 but they continuously have been having the mark down on the website for $40. So I'm going to, you know, bring you candle hauls and bring you candle reviews and candle empties a little bit more on my channel. And you guys let me know if that's something that you would want to see. Until the next time, stay beautiful and I will see you the next time. Bye.